Hello from Slovenia again. Today I will show you again. <laughs> I like to do those um, flowers with the glove. So basically it will be some acrylic paints mixed with pouring medium and dipped with the glove. And I will use my Oxide Black by Amsterdam for the base. <clears throat> for this technique you don't need quite a thick layer of the base because uh, it can eat your colors when you will dip. But I want a nice even coat of the black for the background and Valentine's Day is coming so I will use some red orange colors not pink not a big fan of pinks <laughs> uh, and on this Sunday will be a big collaboration going on uh, organized by Fluid Art Co. and paintings from all the artists will be auctioned and uh, money will go for Peak Century. You will find out more if you will join me. And of course other artists, there are a lot of us. On our big Valentine's collab. So don't miss that out. I will put my video on. I don't know exactly when my video will air. I have to check. I'm working on that. And I'm working on some exciting things that I can't tell you yet, but promise you soon. Oop, has to go back in frame. Okay, my sides are covered nicely. And I will just put these gloves off because they are just messy from the black paint. Okay, and I'm planning to use some of these little piggy pigments. I think that it's Twinkle Sparkle. It's iridescent gold green color. Here is a dry a little bit of dry one on. And I'm using uh, Conecodone Crimson, Cadmium Red, Cadmium Orange, Light Gold and Pearl White and I have some Grenache here too from these little piggy pigments to use it between reds I hope. And I will do the same that I did in last videos I will do some puddles here and then dip it. So I will start with the pearl white. One, two, three puddles.
And let's dip that. For now you don't see, maybe just a little bit of the shimmer. This will be gold green shimmer. So I will just go quickly over the wet results and Stay tuned for the dry results. Had quite some pain here, but now I think that kind of fits. So stay tuned for the dry results. So here is a close up. I look. <laughs> it's, uh, gold green iridescent shimmer pigment and the grenache in the flowers gives them a really nice shimmer too I love it It's kind of different, but it's really cool. Love it. Love it. So, it's hard. This was just a simple balloon dip flowers I like this technique because you can get a bigger flower maybe I wasn't so happy with this middle one but now it's okay so don't forget that on Sunday we will have a piggy love collaboration I did a beautiful piece that you will be able to auction to and before then we see you on Friday. 
bye